threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Oh, good kicks there. Tagged him. Oh, he tagged him again. Well, this is chopping up a lead leg 101. This is exactly the way you do it as the leg kicks continue to pile up. And you can already start to see his opponent slowing down a little bit. May want to check one of those, bro. Pretty good straight punch for him there, Joe. Nice kick there by Brown. Straight right is there. Oh, another nice kick. Solid series of kicks here. Don't be afraid to check one of those, bro. Brown gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, They have started this fight off with a brawl. Oh, uppercut lands, and he leaned right into that one, Joe. Left the head wide open there for the taking. Let's see if now that wakes him up a little bit, and he learns to get those hands up. Damaging strike there. And he's in the Muay Thai clinch. That knee might have landed there. Muay Thai clinch now, Joe. A lot of damage can be done here. Oh, tags him again with a flush left hand. Back to over under control. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. Nice leg kick there by Brown. Forking off the jab, it's good. These guys are swinging. And he gets tagged. Nice combination, Joe. Oh, a lot of volume here. Good series of strikes there. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Lands a nice kick. He's limping. It looks like he's hurt. Hard hook. Nice combination there. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Doing an excellent job of mixing up his strikes here. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Now he goes for the single leg. Brown gets in the clinch yet again. It's very close here. Attempting a triangle, he's able to change course and get this fight to the canvas. Well played right there. Postures up here. Brown gets pounded here on the ground. The elbow there doing the damage. He's getting off some very nice ground and pound here. Oh, lands an elbow. Plenty more where that came from. Nice hammer fist. for the end of round one. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Brittany Palmer in the building. Second round underway. All right, so second round underway. Little bit of a feeling out process, I guess, in that first round. Entertaining action on both sides. Nothing that wowed the crowd necessarily, Joe, but your thoughts ultimately on what we saw over those first five minutes. Both fighters throwing heat now. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, nice job to land the front kick there by Brown. <laughs> we show you the total strikes. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You've got to get that head off the center line. Nice. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Brown. Oh, and there's the spinning back fist, Joe. Oh! Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Brown. Caught that one on the forearm. <laughs> Caught him with a punch. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Brown. Double underhooks. 
And he goes to the knee to the body. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Lands a hip toss. Vision could become an issue in that left eye starting to close. He's trying to get that choke. He's locked in the Japanese necktie. He might get a finish here. He's really cranking down this Japanese necktie now. Just over two minutes now to go in the round. Big punch from the bottom. Oh, that hammer fist attempt defended well. It's blocked. Covering up, doing a nice job of stopping that ground and pound. Now he covers up as the hammer fists are coming. Excellent movement here on the ground. Back to the feet now. Well, Joey seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make it so it's not just one and done when it comes to his striking attack. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Look at that, right to the temple. Nice combination there. Slightly deflected. Brown's leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. That is an obvious win. And that's the end of round number two. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. And there you see some beautiful judo technique. Beautiful submission attempt here, but right at the end, he slips out. Incredible highlights in that round. Third round underway. All right, so the next round is underway here, Joe. A lot to like, really, on both sides tonight, but for me, it's been all about the cardio. I mean, look at these two guys, fresh as a daisy, barely sweating and both bring a lot of stamina into this round. So the work in the gym certainly paying dividends, whether it's training at altitude or three a days, whatever it is, you don't have to worry about the cardio of these two guys abandoning them on fight. Very nice. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Changes his stance. Nice kick to the midsection. Oh, the combinations continue to pile up. Well, he's connecting with his punches now. Took him a while to find the range. He has found it now. Just a slip there. Oh, good lead right by Brown. Well, the strikes keep on coming, and now that eye is so swollen, his vision has to be impaired, Joe. He's in some real trouble. They are trading huge punches here. Three minutes to go in round three. Nice take down there. Excellent posture here. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Back to half guard now. And now he's working from full mount. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, is he an active pursuer of the submission? Now he's pretty deep. Oh, that's nasty. That's it. That's it. That's it. He got in the choke, refused to tap, and went night-night. Well, you've got to admire the toughness, right, to not tap out. Ultimately, he chooses to go to sleep, but offensively needs.